Sekejevia, Historical Questline in Forge of Empires. This month, May 2018, a new historical questline will start telling the story of Sekejevia. She played a role in one of the first expeditions exploring North America. I have been abroad for two weeks, therefore this time you get videos recorded on my iPhone. This quest line contains 14 quests. These are two additional quests compared to previous quest lines, but they can be completed quickly and easily. I just have some small hints, especially for newer players. If you are asked to collect goods, the fastest way to complete this task is to trade goods in the market. Often, production tasks can be completed with blacksmith buildings. This is the reason why many advanced players have some of these tiny Bronze Age buildings in their town. But in Quest 2, production buildings of the current or previous age are required. Those who want to solve the first eight encounters of the guild expedition normally don't need the extra move from the tavern for it. Completing the first four tasks rewards you with an item that can complete a production immediately. This can rescue a daily challenge. If it is requested to build a cultural building, always check first what your inventory contains. Often you still have a building in it that you can place to fulfill the quest. If you are asked to recruit military units, these can not only be received from military buildings or quests, your Alcatraz can complete this quest and the last small platform before every big platform of the first three levels of the guild expedition also provides unattached military units. For the completion of the first nine quests, you receive a large package with medals. If the quest just requires to donate goods to your guild's treasury, you can use Iron Age goods for it. Medals no longer work for this as InnoGames changed that. You receive tavern silver not only by collecting in your tavern. You also can visit other players' taverns and occasionally receive some silver. This can help if only little is missing to complete the quests. You can not only win battles in the guild expedition and on the province map, they are also neighbors. This time the quests do not contain these dislike tasks and everybody should be happy with them. For completing all 14 quests, you will receive the Menagerie, a residential building providing a lot of population plus 10 of a random good of the building's age. This is an impressive building. After building the new Menagerie, Sakajavia and her pets are walking through your city. 